So just typical Florida weather. Sunny right there. Stormy right there. And it's raining where you are. Oh, there's a gator over there. little like six foot gator but i don't know why why is it still raining i want it to stop raining <laughs> i want i want this weather right here right where i'm standing we've been riding around trying to put these stupid traps in the water never fails if i try to go do something the weather will be bad I'm scared. You're scared. I'm definitely scared. I'm scared that I'll get struck by lightning. There was an alligator out there. Okay, new plan. The plan is we're gonna bait up the traps here at the ramp. What do you what'd you get? Sardines. Frozen sardines. delicious because <laughs> I'm filming you I'm filming you why don't you just pay attention to driving <laughs> you don't think I could drive and film at the same time I don't I know all right you ready, B? The gator disappeared. All right, well, it wasn't our first <laughs> spot, the spot that we wanted to go to, but it's still raining over there. It's kind of clearing up over here. Let's drop these traps. If you're gonna be the captain, you gotta do captain stuff. <clears throat> sponsored, but not sponsored by Just Tile It. Yeah. This Hit them up. This video is brought to you by <laughs> Just Tile It, Brevard County. Hit him up, no job, too big or too small. It's also Crystal's dad. Keep going. I don't want to have them so close together. Like we probably got those two too close together. And let's, you know, like let's not have any major landmarks in the background so people can't figure out where we're at. Got it. <laughs> okay. I didn't even ask how deep it was. How deep is it? Twelve feet. Sweet. My mom said just be myself. Um, Corky Bells? Yes. Corky Bells on the boat for dinner? On the boat? Uh. I thought that's what you were talking about. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> something? I felt something. Like a crab trap? <laughs> Maybe. There's one, Ooh. two, three. three. There's at least, okay, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine in that trap. There's still a lot of good bait too. Yeah. We can leave them out. I don't know. What should we do? Leave them out over the weekend. It's Friday. Oh boy. Them are nice sized crabs too. They're all about five inches. That's pretty good, uh, pretty good first trap right there. We're gonna have crabs at the party. It's crabbing season. Number two. Mm, I'm gonna guess five in this one. Five? Five. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna say 10. You? I'm gonna say I don't seven. Know. I don't feel them. I felt them in that last one. Oh. This one was I'm deeper. This five. one was almost 13 feet. There's one, two, one, three, four, two, five. Three, four, five, six. Dang There's it! One. There's a little one in the bottom. Watch your fingers. 
big old female. It's a good it's size. Not nearly as much bait in this particular one. Wonder if they're getting out though. This one's kind of all bent up. Yeah. Alright, how many y'all think? Seven. I said seven last time. This one, I'm gonna say. Gotta make a choice pretty quick. Six. <laughs> Coming up on your right side. Six. I say uh -huh. ten. We got six in last time. There's no way we're gonna have four sixes in a row. Do you feel them? I don't know. See, I feel them. I could tell when they're in there. It's a skill. This is trap number three. Our secret spot in Palatka. <laughs> It's not so secret when you tell everybody. Uh-oh, uh-oh. That's a huge crab right there. It's got a... Woo! Oh, that's good. See, so you know what that is? So, the big males will grab her, and she's getting ready to uh, peel or shed her skin. And what he's doing is holding on to her, so as soon as she sheds her skin, then he'll mate with her. And if I was to take that male crab and leave it in this trap, it would be full of females that are just for whatever reason they get attracted to those males uh, for protection and mating. Look at that big claw though. It's, that thing's He's huge. huge. That, I bet that thing's eight inches across his back. Wait, One, the real two, question, three, how four, five, six, seven, six? seven. Who picked I seven? I said six. I said seven too, didn't I? No. You don't even have it on film. You didn't. Yes. <laughs> the. Go to school. <laughs> The best clips come when you don't know what's happening. Are we guessing on this one? Yeah. I'm gonna guess. I'm guessing five. Four. You always have to one down me. Like, you always have to one deal. up me. I'm going six. Ah! Uh oh. We have four, five, Bad and captain. six, everybody. <laughs> it's okay, I still got it. We have four, five, and six, everybody. Crabby Crystal on the uh, on the crab. She's always crabby. Palatka's deadliest catch. Another Mondo. One, two, One, two three. three, four, Look five. At him. One again. Bianca literally called it two times in a row. Whatever. She should play the lottery. Well, what I'm going to need you to do is count those numbers higher next go round, B. <laughs> Because we're trying to go, we're trying to get ten a trap. Look, that's another huge mondo. I know. Mondo crab. He's probably he's easily eight inches across his back. That big one right there. Whew, is that that one's even? Look at this. Than that one. We like to live dangerously, y'all. So we just dump them <laughs> in the boat first. With our bare feet. <laughs> yeah. Bianca's the only one with her safety shoes on. I got my Wait, South Florida steel toes on. Oh, well, he's trying to get me. But look at that big one right there. That thing is Mondo. And then there's another big one right there. I, I'm gonna measure those in a second, but I bet they're crabs so far. I bet they're at least eight inches from tip to tip. We got twenty inches. So, so far. we'll probably save the little ones for bait. Yeah. Yeah, definitely gonna use them for bait. What? Like, do you think like the weird power plant runoff makes like for gigundo crabs. Like Simpsons crabs? <laughs> yeah, like that night they glow in the dark. I think that this area of Florida has an amazing blue crab fishery and we're just blessed to live here. What's y'all's guesses for the next trap? You say? You, we need your I guess first. Eight. She said eight. I'm gonna go seven. Why wouldn't you go nine? It just blocks her out. Ten. You gotta teach her about gambling. Let's see. I can definitely tell when they're in there. 
Oh, see? One, two, three. Three little ones. Maybe we should go put it on the other end of our string like where that it was way. better. Because that first pot was the best. Yeah, let's do that. Are you ready? Are you ready? No, I'm asking you. I'm ready. All right. I got I'm the, the one, phone ready. I'm the one that's about to pick up the crabs. Can I put them in a the small live well? No. That's so dangerous. Gosh dang it, I already had them one time. Florida man right here. Yeah, right. I'm about to get killed. All for the thumbnail. <sighs> Had one time. Here. <laughs> I'm just frustrated because I had them. I'm holding them. I get it. And we took a phone call. Well, Harold needed to know five pounds or ten pounds of potato salad. Harold. <laughs> Here, set it on the corner <coughs> right behind you. All right. All right, let me see the measure. So, let's see. I almost, trying to take a thumbnail, got <laughs> killed. So that's right on the 20, so that's right on the 27 and to 19 and a half. Let's see, that's... One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight and a half on that one. That one's right at eight. So that crab's eight and a half, y'all. That's a monster. And eight. We only were running five traps, so it's not like we got to pick out of hundreds of traps. Rusties, too. Those will eat good. But look at the deck of this boat right now. <laughs> we uh, like to live dangerously and we're gonna put them in the live well because we're gonna go and try to catch some fish. So, B, how many we got in here? 30. 30 for your birthday party? Yeah, all for your party. Look at them all. Babe? Yeah, sorry. Look at these things. Angry crap. All right, you can help me out, B. All right, y'all. Oh, I've got a bucket of blue crabs. This was all ice. Ice them down so they go to sleep. Oh, it's cold. Oh, it feels good though. It's so oh, hot God, out here. It's so hot. Look oh, at that. Big. And when you ice them down, see they're all still alive. They're just really sleepy. They get cold. And look at these freaks. <laughs> Both over eight inches. That's what he said. Big dogs. <laughs> you don't like my joke? Yeah. <laughs> Anyways, <laughs> I'm going to show you how <laughs> we clean crabs down here in Florida. Now, I know wherever you're from, you probably do it different, and you're going to let me know. But for the most part, everybody I know who's actually from Florida and not a transplant, this is how we do it. So, no offense, transplants. Most of y'all are cool. Um, but that's not a bad day right there. No. 48 hour soak. Um, we have no regulations in Florida. There's no minimum or maximum sizes. Uh, we can keep males and females. Um, and this is for Bianca's birthday party, which is tomorrow. Water slide. So I've messed up and poured all these things out for YouTube. Now they're starting to wake up it's because hot. they it's hot, really hot. But I gotta work quickly here. I'm gonna show you how we do it. This is an absolute monster. Where's my pinch. fillet knife? He's about to pinch you. Hold on. <laughs> he was about to get you. Oh yeah, he's like, I'm awake now. He's ready to He's ready to pinch. So it is a race against time before these bad boys wake up. Mm -hmm. Pull that apron off like so. And then you got your gut bucket right here. And put your hands underneath like, ow. Oh, he's trying to, <clears throat> see, this, I did all this stuff for yeah, you guys. I'm nervous. 
just like that. Ooh. Ooh. And then you pop him off like that. You pull his face basically off like that. <laughs> then the dead man come off like so. They come off real easy, just pull them off like that. And then you've got a crab just like that. What we do, we don't eat the mustard down here. So take you a good uh, high powered garden hose, best way to do it. Just zap that right stuff out. right out of there. And then we steam them whole, just like this. It's party day, it's pop. I almost grabbed the crab because I thought it was a pot holder. <laughs> and I was gonna take, I was like, oh. Not I'm gonna mix, attention. I'm gonna mix like 50% Old Bay uh -huh. and 50% J.O.'s because that J.O.'s is like real salty. It's and my favorite though. It's good, but when you do the crabs the way we do them with the backs off, yeah, yeah. it can get too salty too quick. Look at all those things. Plus it'll probably just make all the crab people even matter that I mix the two. Ooh. And that's, How dare you? <laughs> that's usually like <laughs> the crab police are going to be after me again. So. 50% J.O.'s. I think it's the number two. Whatever the main J.O.'s is and 50% Old Bay. Tastes good. <laughs> We've got uh, some apple cider vinegar and water and a water. Cooler full of crabs. And I'm going to start going in. Layering them. Layering and sprinkling. Delicious. So, and the party's not <clears throat> till noon. Well, noon, but I'm gonna cook them early because just one less thing I gotta do. And I actually kind of like them once they cool down a little bit when I eat them. I don't like to eat them super hot. <clears throat> uh, I don't know how you guys, I actually like them after they've been in the fridge for a couple hours and eating them like that. But Me too. That's not what we're gonna do today. Ah! Another layer, more seasoning. This is not as much fun as when they're still alive. No, it makes for much <laughs> better content, putting them in there alive, which we had multiple problems with these things waking up after being in ice and trying to get them cleaned <clears throat> and filming at the same time. It was a hassle. It was very stressful. So. Just like so. Couple mo. Are you gonna put these in by themselves because they're so big? I was just gonna put those ones right on top. Oh. So when I pull the lid off, everybody sees the big ones. Oh, oh gotcha. They all fit, huh? Perfect. Perfect. I caught the perfect amount of crabs. Mm -hmm. Look how big this thing is. It's ridiculous. It fits. Like just for reference, <laughs> those two are literally just one layer in the pot. And I don't know, eight to 10 minutes with them cleaned like this, I think is how long I'm gonna steam them. Um, Lid back on. See you at the party. Yeah, we'll see you at the party. Cause you guys don't wanna see anything else right now. No. Just the party. Crystal's gonna go down the slide. It's gonna be awesome. No, you're gonna go down the slide. Uh -huh, I, I said it first. <laughs> Marlon's gonna go down the slide. The little thingies, they use it for this. Yeah, you use them for the claws. Yeah, they're awesome. They're, crab claws. they're pretty good, huh? Oh, yeah. They work great. Yeah, you should get some, right? Yeah. Yeah. Toadfish. Yeah. Yeah. Toadfish. <laughs> I got to film some before all the crabs are gone. I already did. They said oh, you did? They love the toadfish. Yes. Really? I said, do say that again so that I can. The toadfish? Yeah, the little, the little scissor thingies. Yeah, yeah. The they work we, great. We got a, uh, a discount code if you want them. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Fletcher was, he said he wanted to show up being it. <laughs> got watermelon, potato salad, deviled eggs, some pulled pork, and buffalo dip. I'm going to turn the camera off and eat. <laughs> so the best thing is you pull the claw off, right? And you got a little bit of meat right there. But what I like using these the most for is that claw meat. So I'll come down and break the claw off. <clears throat> then I'll break that little piece off and I'll take these things and I'll, I'll get it right in here. 
and just, just crack it just enough, right? And then you can you pull that off, and then you bust that little piece, and you get your little meat lollipop. <laughs> Dip it in the butter. Mm -hmm. You ready? I'm so, ready. Okay, do it. That right, your turn. Here's why I love the toad fish. Your turn. I'm getting my own. You do that leg with oh, me. Okay, all right. We're going same time. <laughs> You bust it off, like that, and then you eat that little piece right there. Okay. <laughs> yeah, that part you don't need the toad fit for. No. Then okay. you can eat that bit there. Then uh, get down to this piece. You there? I'm there. So then you take your our toad fish, toad, our toad fish crab uh, yeah. claw crackers, <laughs> and just just a little squeeze right there until it cracks. There you go. I think you got it. Then kind of wiggle it out. Wiggle Pull. it. Oh. Just a little bit. Oh, you, you messed up. <laughs> it's Don't your wait. first one, though. It's your first one. Okay, so. I'll do better next time. Yeah. <laughs> but I'll use my toadfish to get the joint. Exactly. And we'll do it from the other yeah. side, right? And you got a little fork thing too. All right. So you can you can work on that. So even if it is your first crab, toadfish comes through. Absolutely. Right. <laughs> they sure do. And how is it? Couldn't it be easier to eat crab? <laughs> Perfect. He wants more animal crackers. <laughs> Won't trust your daddy. That's you. Mm. I'm eating the smoked fish dip. <laughs> That's a different Great. video. We're going to do this other leg. Are you going to do it one more time? Mm -hmm. All right. Oh, we're gonna dip it. Yeah. Break that piece. Okay. There you go. Then break that now. piece off. Yep. Okay. Then, did you break that piece off on the last one? No, you skipped see, that stuff. I did. Oh, so you, you crackers see? To get that piece off. He's not always a professional. I mean, I'm not a professional <laughs> hardly ever. <laughs> Just kind of like, there yeah. you go, oh, boom. Look at that. Now, now do the cracky piece. Okay. Plus, wiggle, oh. wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Ah. Oh, yeah. <laughs> we did it. Dip. Beautiful. Perfect. So, so now you got to get you some. Yep. Us with our toadfish. You know, it's kind of funny because the tablecloth. I did not pick this color on purpose, but it matches the toad fish. I'd like to point out that I have yet to get anything on my new shirt either. <laughs> yeah, and that is a good one too. I think I got past the over under on that. <laughs> Don't speak too soon. What's that? Just tie the shirt. Oh, that? we oh, wore I did. that one. It's in the beginning, in the beginning of, of this video. Okay. Yep, here's the just That's tile it guy tile. himself. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Yeah. If you need some tile, that's the man. No job too big or too small. All right. Well. That's it. Is this the end of the so, video? I guess this is the end of the video. It's gonna have to be. I would. We uh, have a party. Yeah, I need to entertain the guests. And <laughs> thank you guys. Wait, you gotta do the pinata. Yeah. Well, we're not. We might do that on video. We might not. <laughs> I was gonna fill it with fiddler crabs, but. Um, no. <laughs> Thank you guys for liking, watching, subscribing. Uh, you've been great. We'll see you on the next one.